Okay, let's go. video today we are playing the new zealand waikato tour open in hamilton waikato um so yeah you might remember this cat but please do like and subscribe um and also drop a comment down below what i should name the stray cat um but yeah i'll try and feed them chicken next time i see it this is me illegally recording myself driving to hamilton and this is where we're playing, so in my previous video we played at this exact same spot. What is up guys? We are currently watching Ricky play singles and Stan playing against Jono Curtin. We have Ryan over here, myself, Jay up Thomas, Gang Gang. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh! Did I record that? Oh my god! Oh, did I hit the oh, did I hit the body? Oh, I didn't see that part. Did you nah, I didn't. Look at open players though. Oh, real? Look at open players just uh, making up rules as we go. Oh, let's go! Yeah. So I'm playing with um, Hannah Wu today and we'll be playing mixed doubles a little bit later but first um, I had my first game against this handsome gentleman called Philip who I'll talk about a little bit later um, but yeah enjoy I'll commentate while I guess I play these rallies um, a little bit about Philip is that um, as you can see he's a bit of a rallier like me so um, yeah definitely tested my physical fitness um, but yeah overall it was a good game um, but yeah stay tuned to see who won So I lost that first set um, pretty badly actually. I um, I don't know why, but my body just felt a little bit stiff. Didn't really want to move. Um, and yeah, I guess it was a pretty easy first set for Philip. I know I've said this a thousand times, but I really need to keep my record up higher. No idea how I'm supposed to do that, apart from me just constantly reminding myself, especially like midway during the rally. But yeah, do leave a comment down below if you've got any tips for me. I'm thinking I could um, maybe strip my arm up, maybe, with tape or something. I think in general my footwork is just really bad, it's really slow, it means that because of my footwork I'm not really able to kind of get behind the shuttle and play a more aggressive shot. I think there was a lot of times during this set that I knew that I could have played a more aggressive shot if my footwork was a little bit faster um, and I think at the moment it's probably what's holding me back the most. Right. Yeah. 
I managed to win this um, second set um, to push it to three sets, uh, but it was very close. Uh, I think it was 19-21. So over here, I felt like I could have done a much faster, kind of more aggressive footwork, but I opted for the slow footwork. So this also meant that I kind of cut down my options as well, so whereas I could have smashed, I just opted for the clear, and so I think um, Philip got pretty used to that. And here it happens again. Yeah, so I ended up losing 21-10, and 21-12. Today I'm here with the man himself, Wayne Wu. Yeah. Okay, Wayne. How was your first singles game at the Waikato 2024 Open? Um, yeah, thanks Hannah. I think it was actually really, really good. Um, I played against Philip Dorn, who is a German uh, from Germany. <laughs> <laughs> we played three sets. I lost in the end, but I think it was somewhat close. Third set, I kind of feel like I put my foot off the gas and I just kind of lost concentration. So that was really good at kind of staying consistent, playing out the rallies and yeah, just being consistent essentially. That's kind of what he did. I felt like in my first set and third set, um, I didn't play very aggressively. I kind of just let Philip kind of take the take the reins. Dictate the rallies. To take the rallies and yeah, he was being a lot more aggressive than I was. So mm. I think that's kind of like what led to me losing because um, I can't defend forever. Do you think you're more of a, do you play better when you're playing aggressively and when you're in control of the rally or do you prefer responding and defending? I'm, defini I'm definitely more of a responsive player. I quite like to let the opponent um, play however they want to play and then I'll just react. But I think as I play higher level opponents, I kind of need to um, be a bit more alpha, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Um, but yeah, I just need to kind of be a bit more um, aggressive, kind of take charge of the rallies. Because I think um, in second set, how I won that was just being a bit more aggressive. I kind of, every time that I got a lift, I just smash it instead of like just dragging on the rallies. And especially if you said like Philip was really consistent. Yeah. If you're not going to out consistent him, then you need to cut it off early in the rally. Thoughts? Yeah, I completely agree with you there. Um, yeah, but at the end of the day, Philip played really well. Um, yeah, uh, I'm not going to take anything away from him, but yeah, he played really well. And Wayne now he's... also played really well, guys. Oh, thanks, Hannah. Alrighty, so um, I'm actually not too sure who we played against, but um, this is actually me and Hannah's second time ever playing together. Um, first time that we played together was at Trials, um, but yeah, we just kind of decided to see how we'd play with each other.
So yeah, um, we managed to win this game in um, two sets. Um, I'll put the score up um, on screen. But um, yeah, it was a pretty good game. And um, today I just played mixed doubles with my mixed doubles partner Hannah Wu. I'm Wayne's cousin. And, uh, her last name is Wu too. Yes, we just won our first game. Um, Wayne nearly made the other guy withdraw. Yeah, I made his back sore by doing this amazing cross court drive, and then it forced him to like exert a thousand percent more energy to kind of get that shot, and then that tweaked his back, and then yeah. All right, so Hannah, hey. um, how did you fe feel like our mix went? It was good. We weren't really um, pushed. I was just trying to get used to the court, get used to Wayne's um, crazy badminton. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty happy with Wayne's performance. It is um, acceptable. <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> and I'm excited for round two tomorrow. Yeah. Stay tuned. Something that we needed to kind of work on, what would that be? Um, but I definitely need to rush to the front more instead of hanging around the back when I'm pushed there. Um, I think... Do you want me to say to you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Same I same. think Wayne could, um, instead of sticking to the backhand block um, for most of the shots, you could try an overhead and attack it more. Yeah. But um, I, oh, I'm also usually really bad about thinking about the opponents and what they're doing. I thought that you're really, really fast and you actually kind of cover a lot of the net, which makes my job a lot easier. Um, and I think what I can kind of focus on for the next time is kind of identifying how they play. Because I think um, I just did the same stuff, like what you were saying before, like the backhand block, I just keep doing it straight. But then if I kind of switch to my forehand, I can at least kind of have more options. Um, but yeah, no, I think it was really, really good. Um, looking forward to our game tomorrow. Don't know who we're playing, but yeah, that's it for day one. Oh, that's your. Yeah. Oh, you want to do it too? Me. That looked really not cool. Do it again. Oh, nice. Currently walking to dinner. It's really cold. Give you a little tour of my hometown. This is the central library. There's the city center. That's a tree, that's yellow poles, that's a green pillar, there's benches, that's Hamilton. You guys wouldn't believe, so I was just walking over there, <laughs> and then I've got my high school mates just sitting here. Oh, yeah. no, leave no, no. a comment. Hey, straight <laughs> leave, up. Leave a comment. Yeah. If, you're, if you're not first, you're last. Yeah. Can like ask? and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Wayne. <laughs> <laughs> Can we ask them the cake question? <laughs> What's the cake question? Oh, oh, oh. I'm not saying. Oh, wait, you can't put this on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, I won't. No, I won't. Get demonetized. Okay. So we out here at Eat Burger. Eat Burger. Um, how's your food? <laughs> um, it's a little bit too salty. Um... All right, Liam, how's your food? Oh, Linton, how's your burger? Very good. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, sorry, yeah, well, how's your burger? Oh! <laughs> so you've got some chicken, you've got some lettuce. It looks quite, like, quite a messy burger. <clears throat> um, yeah, sorry, you said it was a bit salty. It's actually way too salty. <clears throat> What'd you get, Vincent? Wow, double meat. Double meat. <laughs> What'd you get? Dirty burger, man. Dirty burger. I like it dirty. Oh, how's your burger? How, how's your food? It's great. Brian, how's your food? It's really good. <laughs> what, what, what burger did you get, Jono? A fancy. Fancy? Yup. How's your burger? Good. You wanna see? <laughs> <laughs> Ricky, how's your burger? Oh, your food? No. Oh, there's no food here. <laughs> On a scale of 0 to 10, how hungry are you? Oh, uh, nah, about a 5. 5. On a scale of 0 to 10, how hungry are you? On a scale of 0 to 10, how tired are you? Tired. And how hungry are you? So that's transported by robots? And I forgot what burger I had, but dinner was done. That's day one complete. 
tune in for next time for part 2.